morning. Morning. Got my log. Log thing. Yeah. Um, if you're new here, I'm Katie. I'm B. And if this happens to be the first vlog that you're watching, we will leave above all of the rest of the trip because we have been here for two and a half weeks. But we've just checked out the Grand Prix. But we've just come to the Grand Prix Cafe because we're here for the two and a half I think so. Big old Mickey Waffles as well, from what I remember. They were big brown ones or big Mickey ones. Sriracha honey. <laughs> or normal honey for Katie. <laughs> and we brought our reusable mugs in with us so that we've got this drink and they've just got ice water. They don't seem to mind us doing that. It's just casual night, it's fine. Yeah. Um, and then this is our view. So I requested when I checked in a window view that so apparently it went through as a bit. So I kept apologising. I was like, oh, you have a window? I was like, that's who I wanted. Yeah. Yeah, I said, like, this is such a nice view. This is actually the building that we were in. Yeah. Building nine. I don't want to go on. Yeah, I know. So when they bring over the special honey just for me that isn't spicy, and they're going to give Dean two lots of the sriracha one. I might try a little bit, but I'll dilute it with my honey. <laughs> This makes me feel a little so you, less you, sad. You, you did say you hadn't had a Mickey, that many Mickey Rockers this trip, so first day, last day. What we said. Yeah, that's very true, because we had them on our first. The trip's been running off of Mickey Waffles. <laughs> we got a little Mickey Waffles sandwich of the holiday. <laughs> oh, it looks so good. Verdict on brunch slash lunch. Our chicken waffles are amazing. Mm. Do you, do you, is there anything else on the menu? Well, apparently there are other things on the menu, but for us personally, not worth having. Well, you, you started looking at the menu and I was like, what are you doing? <laughs> you can order the chicken You know waffles. you're going to get food, MV. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, that was really nice. You could tell they were a bit backed up today. <clears throat> so we were a little bit late for our reservation because we were waiting for bell services. I um, get them in warning anyway. But then it was still like another 15 minutes or so. So it is something to be mindful of at Disney. But your reservation time doesn't necessarily mean it's something you can say. Yeah, absolutely. It's something you have to be back. Yes, indeed. We are now going to get the monorail. We have backed up to Genie Plus. Um, we mentioned previously that our tickets came with Genie Plus. We got them at a time where they were doing that as part of a deal. It's a deal that's not on anymore. Uh, so we have the freedom of having Genie Plus included and not paying for it each day because if we were not if we didn't have them included we wouldn't have paid for them today i don't think no, probably not because we're just or if we did then we wouldn't have probably had brunch and we'd have literally just been spending the time um in the yeah. park making use of them so i'll oh, just mr monorail so if that's why it looks like we're sort of not using our gd plus to its full capacity that's why it's because it was already included and we've well and truly got our money's worth out of it. So we missed a monorail, so I'm gonna have a very quick look in basin because it smells so good. These are all so cool. They're like eight dollars each. I don't know if that's it depends on how much they weigh. I wonder if they're slightly different. Seven ninety nine. No, they're all eight dollars. So they are quite expensive but they're cute. So it looks like Basin also do their own Mickey Mouse foam shaper, but in here they are $20 each. Different fragrances, but I mean, but they also have a Pluto one, a Mini and an Olaf, but I think they all just pump, oh no, look, that one pumps out a paw. And then yeah. Minis is like a flower, and then Olaf, I yeah. don't really know what that would be. I'm gonna guess it's like a, uh, Thank you. that pretty well if I say so myself. I'll use the ramp this time I think. I feel like 
is more chilled coming into this park a bit later on in the day. Yeah. Yeah, we've got the um, park up a rush anyway. Yeah. Right, where's your first? Buzz and space, they're at exactly the same time. Nice. But if we go on space first, we can then book another one. Was Buzz not our most recent one? Oh yes, never mind, yeah. So Buzz first Buzz then. first, yeah. Really, so you are getting rid of the um, yeah. turret ribbon. Yeah. You didn't notice that, because the, yeah, the front couple are off. Yeah, no, it looks, I swear it's looked different every day we've come in. So, we got on Tron two minutes after the enrolment time, and we did get a spot in the queue, but it's going to be far too late. It was one for three in around 68 minutes, so you're probably looking at like at least a seven, eight plus. And we all be long gone by then. I mean, yes, maybe if we we'll got on it. We'll still be in the Floridian, the Floridian area. Yeah, but um, not. No, not knowing it, did we? No. Um, so we have left that queue. We've got Buzz. We're in a really long, lightning lane queue for Buzz. Um, I've not seen it have to go to the outside. Um, so we're going to do this, then we can book another team on Buzz. Then hopefully, do the people mover and the place mover. Yeah. And then we'll see what else we can get on. Anything else will be a bonus. We're going to leave the park at like four, so we've still got three hours. But it's mad how quick we can See what we can do in three hours. Yeah, exactly. Let's see how much we can fit in with Genie Plus on the last three and a bit hours of a trip. There will be some shopping. Just some snacks. Snacks. I can go with that. And Pandora Charm. <laughs> It's all been happening, it's all been happening. We got stuff on the ride, didn't we? <laughs> we did get stuff on the ride. And I got Galactic Hero! I mean, it doesn't massively count because... I got, I got up to 961, so I was aiming for a volcano, but Katie told me there's a tiger right in front of her that she kept it on. And I, I went for gold <laughs> too early. I know, uh, and that, to be fair, I then hit the volcano like three or four times, yeah. and in the first room, I'd managed to get the robot's one. hand once, I got it the one. inside of the but hand. It's so irritating because if you can get, you can't get the angle on it because they'll put your car as it turns and block in my breath. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and well, I suppose whenever I'm there, the car's in the way. <laughs> but my life's complete. No, I got not. Galactic Era. <laughs> I got 961. I don't know, you get, you've got to go on a quiet time to properly get it, I think. Yeah, and also we were in our own cars, which I think yeah. makes a difference. Um, but yeah. Yes. <laughs> You're now in the presence of a galactic hero. <laughs> what can I say? One and only, and it's only because the ride went down. Like, there no, is I no think, way. I think we'd get it on a quieter time because we both know where the hand is. Yeah, maybe. We both know where the, like, the big scores are. It's just been so many lazy people going around. We're getting the same target. Okay. Miss out. We'll try and Disneyland Paris soon. Stitch is out. Hey, Stitch. <laughs> Paris. I 
but it is way better than that right there. Yeah, because you actually get like, some downhill momentum so you get yeah. the speed up. Oh, that you just chug, 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 chug it. Also, you see a bit more on the other one, like it actually has a bit more to it. Yeah. Um, Over being a space. I mean, as good as that ride can be, I, mean, I think it's cute for little kids and stuff, but I'm glad we did it. It's nice to always do it once, but it's smelly and hot, so yeah. be warned. Try to do it on a cooler day. Yes. Or first thing in the morning. Uh, we are now hopefully going to do the people mover if it hasn't got too long a wait. So it's 2.08. Let's see how long it takes to clear this. I think it won't be very long. Five, ten minutes max. That wasn't bad. That looked like not a really long queue. It's a decent size queue and it's taken us five, six minutes to get up to the top landing and about to get in one of the vehicles. So not bad, you can always rely on the people mover, although you know it's an insanely busy day if the people mover is really long way. I don't know why, it's one of my favourites. Everyone should want to come. Please supervise younger beings. Please stay clear of the doors, which will open and close automatically. Enjoy your journey. Let us this is the TTA Blue Line, non-stop service around the world. Okay. Looking in. Greetings, intergalactic travelers. Welcome aboard the People Mover, presented by Enterprise. I'm Orak 5, your guide aboard this highway in the sky. The absolute best way to see tomorrow. Green and red lines. Don't worry, your express train keeps on rolling through the future. Right by two of my favorite spots. Seems to be going backwards. We've been temporarily delayed. I don't know, it's quite nice for us. Could you do that? It would be nice if we were stuck inside of the aircon. Disney, so never 
leave things for the last minute, we have learned this. Because that's how dining reservations and genie buses and various other things get missed. <laughs> and that's why we're not pushing ourselves too much today to try and do too many rides too close to us having to leave. Yes. Because if that happens, then you start... I'll be late for the plane. Yeah. Like the plane so I that is, and I won't be late for the plane. No. No. Indeed. So now, should we go do pirates? Let's do it. Aircon. Pirates. Just cut the skeletons playing chess. What you doing? I am getting us another light plane as far as we've got time to do one more to avoid the parade. Yeah. We've got um, Big Thunder Mountain for 10 past 3, so we'll be able to go straight from this town. because the parade will have already gone past this route. It's, it starts at the back of Adventureland near where... It comes out next to Splash Mountain, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that this is where it comes yeah, out. Yeah, because that's where we got stuck before. Yes, um, and then it goes all the way around through Liberty Square, around the castle, like the central hub area, down Main Street, and it goes around Main Street and um, ends there. Um, they go in sort of the side entrance there. The side entrance we've been up and down a couple of times. It's one where they do the tree trails. No, it's the other side actually. Do you go on the other side? Yeah, they do. They go in by the fire and the oh, firehouse. I thought they went in by the well, that's Disneyland that's Paris. Disneyland Paris, yeah. Um, so, I think that that plan will have worked. So yeah, we'll do Big Thunder. Then I don't think realistically we've got time for anything else unless no. it was like straight away. No. There's actually a few rides that are down today. They've got... Aladdin's down. Aladdin at the minute, oh, is it? Well, earlier on today it was Aladdin, Winnie the Pooh, and the Little Mermaid, which is all a bit unusual. And they were down for quite a while. This is what uh, Splash Mountain looks at in May. They're saying Tiana's food. A lot of people have been asking, oh, there's going to be like a restaurant here. But on our Keys to the Kingdom tour, they knew nothing about a restaurant, did they? No, I mean, the theme is. All the wait times have gone down a bit, understandably. Oh look, there's work. the end of the parade. But we can just see it just down. There we go. We can just see the end of the parade. So, our strategy has worked. Oh, thank you so much to all of you who just stopped us to say hello. Honestly, it absolutely makes our trip. Um, I, still, I still feel very good, but it is really yeah. nice. What an amazing trip those guys are on as well. They've literally been to California and um, they are now here in Disney World. That actually was the trip that we were thinking about doing, wasn't it? But we yeah. ended up going for Hawaii <laughs> and staying on that side and doing this as well because... No. Can you make? <laughs> Can't do it one. Yeah. Um, but right, it is time for Big Thunder.
I got my darling husband <laughs> mint chocolate chip. Done. Okay, okay, not chocolate chip. Are you happy? I'm happy. I'm happy. Good. Ice cream with a view. <laughs> <laughs> Holiday made. I mean, this holiday was amazing anyway. Oh, is it just that? that, that. <laughs> but we just met. And to be fair, I met them in the line, but we sat right by them when we were having our ice cream sundae. And we had a little chat. Yeah. And yeah, they were really fun. lovely. So that has made leaving a tiny bit better. The fact that we have finally got to meet Tim and Jen Trapper. <laughs> yeah, they were really lovely, really lovely. Now it's time to have a little mooch in the shop. Tim Tracker said he thought it was gonna rain, so I trust his judgment, so we are going to try and get out of here so that we can go get changed. I do think we're gonna get sport in a storm going out of the Tampa. Absolutely. Um, let's have a little mooch in the shop, get changed. Find a napkin so that I can wipe chocolate fudge sundae off of my shoe and leave the pot. Find yourself a husband who will rub chocolate fudge sundae off of your trainers when you drop it. Me loves you. Ah, oh, one last trip for some Disney treats. I need to get a Rice Krispie treat for my friend Beth. So I need to decide which one to get. Uh, and maybe a little treat for us. Yeah, yeah, I like your style. So two on air, five on air, and a bow. Yeah, but then they've got it with pink as well. So this one is like a limited release one. So I think this one's quite good. I might need to just see what the dates are on them because that's going to determine. They're amazing. They're amazing. Yeah. No, I'm just thinking. <laughs> Sorry, yeah, it's a bit thick. Fine. I'm like so far down here, it's like I can't hear it. Don't worry, I get Dane a lot. It doesn't work. It doesn't work for now. Thank you very much. Dane just having a cheeky little flirt with the cast member there. I see ya. I see ya, husband. Good purchase. I'm all this way. Um, because we used the rest of our cash, it felt like free money, so yeah. <laughs> free food. Free food, yeah. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Um, now we've got some more changes for the tip. Yes, absolutely, because Bell Services have like eight of our pieces of luggage. Yeah, and uh, we, we, we didn't have any change earlier to tip. We <laughs> um, no, no, we'll just back end the tip. Right, should we take one last look at the castle? It's getting breezy. Yeah, look at that. The storm clouds are rolling in. So it's definitely time for us to head out. Um, I feel like something's happening because there's like a few cast members around, but we are heading out. We well, are. Don't only get board, is it? No. no. Bye. Bye. So to get back to the resort, we can either get the resort monorail, which goes contemporary. TTC. TTC. Does it stop at the TTC? I yeah. don't know if it goes yeah, to Oh yeah, Translation Ticket Centre slash Magic Kingdom Parking, Polynesian and then Grand Floridian. So it is a longer way, we could just get the boat. But if it's about to chuck it down with rain, if we get the um, uh, monorail, then we're under cover the whole time we don't have a room to go yes. back to anymore. Oh, we don't have a room. Oh, so we got uh, oh. No, so this is this is better. This saves us getting wet. A lot of people have messaged us asking about Tampa yes. and the route. So we will film getting to Tampa, how easy it is to give the car back, like just what there is to do at the airport. Yeah, because those people that have done MCO, but not many have done Tampa, especially yeah. with Virgin. Yeah, exactly. So we will carry on this vlog for a little bit longer. We'll just get more and more depressed. Yeah. But, and we've got to pull the giants, but. Yeah, but, sorry, not sorry. <laughs> yeah, just so that we can give a uh, an honest review, really, of flying out of Tampa. This is a new DVC villa at Polynesian Resort. I think it's going to look a little bit like a line uh, with a big lobby in the centre, which you can see is probably just in there. There's a, there's a 
We are now stopping at Disney's Grand Floridian Resort and Spa, a Victorian-style hotel offering the modern conveniences of a full-service spa and health club. Please hold on to the handrails and stay clear of the doors until the monorail stops completely. This is Disney's Grand Floridian. Cause I gotta say you're looking like a gift for me Wrapped up nice and neat, babe Dean has done an amazing job driving down to Tampa We have been through some horrendous um, rain Like literally couldn't see the road So he did amazing We've just stopped off about 10 minutes outside of Tampa Because we need to take our car back full of gas um, We could have sent it back empty But they'd have charged us like an insane amount for the fuel so we decided that we would fill up on our way back um we were going to go to the hard rock cafe that is at tampa airport however i was like oh, i'll just look it up and look at the menu and stuff and it turns out that it closes at 7 p.m so that's not very helpful because the time is 706 <laughs> um because our flight's not till 10 45 and we're not mega hungry because we've had a sundae, we've had a peanut butter cookie, um, and we also had the Grand Floridian um, earlier, but we do want something. And although they'll give you food on the plane, as soon as we get on the plane, we literally just wanna like try and get some sleep because it's gonna be like, probably like midnight by the time they actually give you anything. Um, and yeah, just wanna try and get some sleep. So uh, we've stopped at Walmart, I say which is 10 minutes away from the airport to get the fuel and I did a little search and there is a Chick-fil-A five minutes away that's on the way to the airport. Florida weather so we've got rain one side of the petrol station and then it stops. Yeah literally it stops just the other side of the tree. It's not raining here as far as I can tell. That's mad. Obviously got to stop somewhere but I've never seen it that close apart from when I was younger. Madness. Um, so yeah off to Chick-fil-A, we yeah, go. Yeah, hard rock. We wanted the pin. How much did that cost to fill the car up? What? Uh, it was like 17 quid. 17 dollars, 18 dollars. Oh, okay. But that, and that was for about a quarter of a tank, wasn't it? Yeah. We've only had to fill this car up once. I think we won't have even used a whole tank of fuel, actually. I think I'm going to fill up a little bit higher, so it should be full by the time we take it back to the airport. Perfect. So, on to Chick-fil-A. I've got the route. We have discovered Chick-fil-A. And we like it. Time to eat. Of course it's a bit the Giving back our car. Good old Vader, as voted for on Instagram. It was a good car. And, bro, I mean, Darth Vader, I don't think, was in Rogue One, was he? Yes, he was. Oh, was he? Well, there we go. Look, we had a Rogue and Vader just fitted. Yeah, yeah Rogue One between the two. Uh, but we've... Re so we've returned to the car center that was mega mega easy we've used alamo um, we now have to go over here to the terminal there's a little final monorail and then we get to say goodbye to <laughs> then we get to say goodbye to these bags and head through security And we are through security. There's One thing to note yeah. is don't go straight to the terminal, which is on level three. Well, that, so, well, you do go straight to the terminal. But yeah, but don't like go, not the main terminal section, yeah. which is marked just to the terminal one. Yeah. Level three, you go, go to, to two level two because check that's in. where check-in so is. So we weren't the only ones walking up with our bags, back down on, back down on floor. Yeah. But then through security, no problems. No problem at all. This airport is super quiet. We must be one of the last flights. But we will say, yeah, eat before you come because there's not really anything, and anything that is here isn't open. Um, yeah. Which we found in 
LA. LA. Literally yeah. Didn't, nothing like reopened until about eight o'clock. Um, we get to go into a lounge um, because we um, did a bid and we upgraded to upper. Um, so it says International Club Lounge. I'm assuming I'm that's sure where that we're one. going. But otherwise, there's loads of seating, um, but there just isn't anywhere to eat. Like they, it, they said that there's a Starbucks, there's an Illy, like there's a few places, but so they're all, as you can shop. see, closed. So if you've got a late flight. Don't. Yeah, don't don't come. Go, yeah. And if you do come here, even though it's we found that Chick Fil A the other side, everything can it's all closed, wasn't it? Yeah, I think there's a Wendy's that was yeah, still open, but. Absolutely. Let's go for a little tour of the lounge. So you can see there's lots of um, charge points for your phone and laptop needs, and over across here all your food. Treats, cookies, coffee needs. Although for a 10.45 flight, I don't think coffee is the one. Food. It was better than the Orlando one. The food looked all right. It wouldn't be like an upper or main meal, but it looked. So the sandwiches look really good. Yeah. I think just whatever's in the hot plates look. Yeah, look, no, look really I think nice, it does look nice. There was loads of drink and food, like cozy seats. Yeah. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. For those of you still in the lounge, please join us as we head down to the gate. <laughs> it is time for break. Thank you for coming to the lounge. <laughs> this airport is just deserted. Everyone is just down the far end waiting to board. Yeah, it's just that flight, I think. Yeah. We met a lovely couple in the lounge, Kevin and Jill. Yep, thank you for saying hello. Yes, yeah, thank you so much for saying hello. Honestly, like, I know you've said it a few times, but it literally means the world when people stop and say hello. Still, still surprised. Yeah, every time. Um, but now, time to board the plane. Our holiday is officially over. Thank you. 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 Thank Six months later? Yeah. <laughs> <Ish>. <laughs> we, we, we've reached the end of our vlog series of our Disney moon. Um, we had the most amazing time. Yeah, thank you for everyone that followed along, yeah. commented, sent us messages. Yeah. It, we really appreciate it. Yeah, it was amazing to have you there with us as we were there. And also, just to relive it all over the last six months. It took us a little bit longer than planned to get all these vlogs out, but we got oh, there What you do like it's in a way. It does. <laughs> It does, but yeah, thank you so, so, so much um, for watching. Whether you've watched the whole series, you've joined in for a view, this is your first one. Thank you. Um, so please hit like if you enjoyed. And subscribe. And we will be back very, very soon with a bit of Disney, bit of non-Disney, bit of life. Who knows? Mm. But oh, we, we, we know. We've got well, we some know. stuff. <laughs> <laughs> but there'll be... There are, there are some upcoming vlogs. Yeah. So they'll be with you very soon. So make sure that you stay tuned. Bye.